Well, it's for two aspects of the weather over the next uh, 24 to 36 hours. Um, the first is uh, for wind. The winds will be high today and through tonight and for a lot of tomorrow uh, in many parts of the country with uh, gusts in excess of 100 kilometres per hour. Uh, and that includes virtually everywhere. Um, but the strongest gusts are most likely to occur uh, across uh, the northwest today and uh, across the southwest during the early part of tomorrow. And then there'll be a, a decrease uh, during the later part of tomorrow. And the other aspect of the warnings for today and tonight and the early part of tomorrow is for uh, showers which are going to turn wintry and they'll be producing quite a bit of snowfall during the course of tonight. OK, so what areas are at risk of snowfall? Winds, people are used to dealing with snow, certainly causes more problems. Yeah, well, it's happening at night time, so the impact won't be uh, that um, threatening. Uh, but nevertheless, um, from, from the, hours of, you know, the early hours of darkness uh, today uh, through until roughly 9 or 10 in the morning. Um, showers coming in from the Atlantic uh, will be producing snowfall uh, virtually everywhere apart from perhaps the, um, the southeast of the country um, because that area is furthest away from the Atlantic influence. Um, there will be deposits of, of snow because temperatures will be falling during the night. Uh, so several centimetres uh, can be anticipated in most places, including low levels, not just at high levels today and tonight. OK, so even us in the Bambi South here in Cork, we might get a bit of snowfall. Uh, not, not out of the question. Um, there's been a fair bit of uh, snow in, in Cork over the uh, two weeks ago, um, oh, no. people remember. Um, so the a similar situation is possible during uh, the course of tonight. Uh, but having said that, um, there will be a big change during tomorrow. Um, there'll be quite a lot of sunshine around and uh, the general ambient temperature of the air over Ireland will change. The temperatures will rise fairly quickly tomorrow. So any snow left over from the night time will uh, melt virtually everywhere except ah, okay. on high ground. So nice and short-lived. Looking mm. a few days ahead, I know there was some talk that it might get colder towards the weekend. Are the models still showing that or uh, could we perhaps escape the worst uh, worst excesses of that cold snap? Probably it's going to be felt elsewhere. Well, it's staying cold generally through the week. Um, there'll be, it'll be slightly less cold during the middle of the week when some rain will come in from the Atlantic to affect a, affect a lot of places. Uh, there is a sign, though, that uh, it will be turn cold again uh, from Friday through the weekend. Uh, details are pretty sketchy at the moment, and you know, those indications could change. But there is a signal for um, you know, cold air to return this time from the east and uh, produce perhaps some wintry showers along eastern and southern coasts. 